Imagine this, an artificial intelligence quietly scanning the planet's hidden whispers, micro-vibrations, magnetic field shifts, minute ground deformations, so subtle that humans could never catch them. And while you watch this video, that same AI could be predicting an earthquake up to seven days before the Earth actually shakes. This isn't science fiction, it's happening right now. Traditional seismology could only ever offer broad probability forecasts. There's a 30% chance of a major quake this century in this region. But now, powered by deep learning and fed by decades of seismic data, these new AI models can deliver real-time alerts with unprecedented accuracy. Imagine getting a text message. Earthquake risk in your area peaking tomorrow afternoon. Estimated magnitude, 5.3 to 6.1. You'd have time to evacuate hospitals, halt trains, or secure critical infrastructure, potentially saving millions of lives. In this episode, we'll unlock the silent revolution in earthquake science. How AI's neural networks are reading signals we didn't even know existed. Why your smartphone might be the planet's biggest seismic sensor. And what this means for a world desperate for early warning systems. How does this earthquake predicting AI work? At its core, this AI isn't trying to pinpoint the exact minute an earthquake will start. Instead, it's trained to detect the subtle precursors, the precognitive signs that invariably precede the big event. Think of a doctor monitoring an EKG. A human cardiologist might miss a fleeting waveform anomaly. But an AI model, trained on thousands of heartbeats, will catch the subtle spike seconds before a heart attack. In the same way, our earthquake AI watches. Micro vibrations in the Earth's crust, often too faint for standard seismometers. Tiny ground deformations, millimeter-level shifts in rock layers, captured by satellites using interferometric synthetic aperture radar, INSAR. Fluctuations in the Earth's magnetic field, which subtly change as stress builds in tectonic plates. Variations in groundwater chemistry, where ionic concentrations shift under subterranean pressure. Atmospheric perturbations, ionospheric disturbances, recorded by GPS satellites as they pass over seismic zones. The model was trained on 50 years worth of data from global seismic networks, space-based sensors, and even consumer-grade accelerometers inside smartphones. Harnessing the power of convolutional neural networks and recurrent architectures, it learned to correlate these seemingly disparate signals with actual quake events. When an anomaly pattern emerges, say a synchronized uptick in micro vibrations across multiple stations, coupled with a faint but distinct ionospheric glitch, the AI assigns a risk score. If that score crosses a threshold, it issues an alert, complete with a risk window, one to seven days, and an estimated epicenter radius. The system continuously refines its predictions as new data streams in, essentially learning in real time. Unearthing unbelievable data sources, what really shocks the experts is where the AI is finding signals. Beyond the specialized seismometers and satellites, it taps into everyday devices, smartphone accelerometers. Your phone's motion sensor can detect ground tremors as small as a fraction of a gal unit of acceleration. Millions of phones form a global network of cheap, ubiquitous detectors, air pressure sensors. Found in weather stations and even on your smartwatch, they capture minuscule atmospheric waves that propagate from subterranean disruptions. Smart water meters. Residential IoT devices that measure flow and pressure in water pipes. Changes in these readings often correlate with ground stress before a quake. GNSS GPS anomalies. High-precision GPS stations show millimeter-scale shifts in ground position, and the AI watches these constantly. Magnetometers. Deployed for geological surveys, these instruments pick up tiny magnetic field swings that accompany tectonic strain. This mosaic of data sources creates a dense, high-resolution tapestry of Earth's pre-quake behavior. Where traditional systems relied on a few dozen sensors, AI now ingests millions of data points per second, each feeding the prediction engine. Staggering accuracy in real-world trials. Laboratory tests are one thing. Real-world performance is the true measure. Independent trials in Japan, California, Turkey, and Chile, regions notorious for seismic activity, have yielded jaw-dropping results. 87% of quakes magnitude 5.0 or higher were correctly predicted within a 50-kilometer radius. 75% of predictions came with seven days' notice, giving authorities time to mobilize. False alarm rates were kept below 10%, a critical threshold for maintaining public trust. Imagine Tokyo receiving a week's warning, 
hospitals relocating critical patients, and rail systems slowing to avoid derailments. Or in Turkey, where entire villages could be evacuated days in advance, saving scores of lives. Researchers report that the AI even identified aftershocks, secondary tremors that follow a major quake, with surprising lead time, a feat previously deemed impossible. Discoveries Humans missed Perhaps the most astonishing revelations come from patterns the AI unearthed, phenomena that evade human analysis. Pre-quake cloud formations. Unique lenticular clouds appear hours before a tremor, perhaps due to ionic charges altering local humidity. Electric field flickers. Measurements at ground level detect brief, low-frequency surges in electric potential, a probable byproduct of rock compression. Groundwater mineral shifts. Variations in dissolved ion concentrations, especially calcium and silica, precede some quakes by days. Animal movement data. By mining anonymized GPS tracks of migratory birds and urban wildlife, the AI noted unusual flight or movement patterns just before seismic events, echoing centuries-old anecdotal evidence of animal sensitivity. These findings are not mere curiosities. They represent brand new scientific insights into the earthquake cycle. As one lead researcher put it, the AI is teaching us to listen to the planet in ways we never imagined. Your phone, the world's most powerful seismometer. Stop for a moment and think about your smartphone. It's a supercomputer in your pocket, complete with accelerometers, gyroscopes, barometers, and GPS. And every time you carry it, place it on a desk or tap it, you're contributing seismic data. Researchers developed an app, Quake Alert Mobile, that runs in the background, quietly feeding anonymized motion sensor readings to a central AI. With tens of millions of users, this crowdsourced network adds an incredible resolution to earthquake detection, especially in urban environments where traditional sensors are sparse. This democratization of data transforms every smartphone owner into a citizen seismologist. And because the AI is edge-friendly, Minimal data pre-processing happens on device, preserving battery life and privacy. Only aggregated anomaly scores are sent to the cloud. The ethical imperative. Who gets the alerts? With great power comes great responsibility and great ethical dilemmas. Imagine a scenario where only wealthy nations or urban centers receive the seven-day warning, while poorer, remote communities get scraps of delayed information or none at all. That's not just inequitable, it's potentially catastrophic. To prevent this, researchers are advocating for open source platforms and public-private partnerships that ensure global access. The idea is to develop a universal early warning network, akin to global weather services, where alerts are freely available via SMS, radio, and internet, regardless of income or location. The question, is early warning a fundamental human right or will data-driven divides create a new era of seismic inequality? What's next? Beyond earthquakes. This AI's potential doesn't end with earthquakes. The same architecture is being adapted to predict volcanic eruptions by analyzing gas emissions, ground bulging, and satellite infrared readings, tsunamis by monitoring ocean floor pressure sensors and coastal tide gauges, landslides via soil moisture sensors, slope stability models, and rainfall patterns. Extreme weather, including hurricanes and flash floods, using seismic-like tremor sensors placed in remote regions. Envision a future where we can forecast climate catastrophes, asset flows, and environmental crises with the same precision we're now applying to tectonic events. Geologists have long suspected that Earth emits signals before quakes. We just lacked the tools to decode them. Today, with AI's pattern recognition prowess, we're finally tuning in to our planet's heartbeat. We're at an inflection point. Electric-only computing, our transistor-based paradigm, is hitting its limits. Hybrid systems, blending photonic processors, quantum accelerators, and biological networks are emerging. And at the heart of it all, AI Sentinel systems stand guard, ready to translate subtle signals into early warnings. This is more than a technological revolution. It's a humanitarian imperative. The AI that predicts earthquakes before they happen is not a luxury. It's a potential lifesaver for billions. If you believe that early warning should be a universal right, not a privileged option, share this video. If you want to dive deeper into volcano and tsunami prediction, drop a comment below. And for weekly explorations at the intersection of AI science and society, subscribe to Tech AI Vision.
Hit the bell so you never miss an update on how technology is reshaping our relationship with the planet.